Hi guys, this is Amalia from Crafty Dreams Studio. Today we're going to be working with the I Love You With My Whole Heart transfer. This transfer actually says, I love you with my whole heart for my whole life. I absolutely fell in love with this transfer because it's so versatile. It's great, especially Mother's Day is around the corner to make something like this to give to your mom. It's great to make a project and give it to a child that's going off to college. They can take it with them to their dorm. Or if you have any friends or family that are going overseas, you can make them a great little keepsake to take with them. So let's get started. I'm going to show you what to do with a brand new transfer. When you get your transfer, it comes in a clear package like this then the transfer is on a white paper and this is called a carrier sheet on the back of your carrier sheet you're going to want to write back now the reason that you want to do this is because you want to remember when you're done with your transfer and it's clean you're going to put it back on the sheet but you don't want to put it on the wrong side or it'll ruin your transfer Okay, so I have my transfer, I have my surface, I'm going to be using this chalkboard. I have my angled squeegee to help me spread out the paste. The paste color I'm using today is the white. Now this is a two ounce bottle that I have, but now if you go to my website, they're moving to the three ounce size. So as you can see, that's a significant difference. So. This is, if you order through my site, you'll be receiving the three ounce bottle, which is the, this size bottle. I'm going to be using my two ounce bottle. Before we get started with our transfer, first step is to write back on the carrier sheet. Then we need to fuzz our transfer. What does fuzz mean? Well, the transfer is extremely sticky, which is good because you want it to stick to your surface. But when you first use it, or when you use it, you want to fuzz it up, which simply means that you put it like on a towel like this, and you want some of the fuzz from the towel to rub onto the transfer so this is not as sticky. Okay. It's still gonna give you great contact on your surface, but it helps it helps when you uh, want to remove it. Now, if you see, I'm picking up the transfer from the corner, but I'm pulling it up straight up this way. You don't want to pull your transfer from corner, from diagonal, from this corner to this corner, because it can tr it can uh, stretch your transfer. All right, so I have that all done. Now I'm going to place my transfer on my surface, which is this chalkboard right where I want it and let's see that looks good to me and then I'm gonna press it down making sure it's making full contact I don't want any bubbles on my transfer or surface perfect now I'm going to take my paste and when you get an new bottle of paste you want to make sure to stir it so can you hear that it kind of sounds like rice krispies popping you want to stir it until you don't have any more of that sound which doesn't take long good stir ready to go okay now I'm gonna take my squeegee Get some chalk paste. And when I apply it to the surface, I'm not gonna apply it right over the letters. I'm gonna start up higher to the side and then press down. And as you can see, a little bit of paste goes a long way. Now, our paste dries fairly quickly, so you wanna work at a rapid pace making sure you get all of the transfer covered. Then 
One great thing about our paste is once you have the transfer covered, there's no waste because you just put the extra paste that you have left over back in your bottle, back in your container. Here we go. Let me get that excess off. And because this is paste, it can wipe off. So if you find that you went a little off the transfer, I can clean that up after with some water. So not to worry about that. So I have my transfer taken off the excess. Now it's time for the reveal. Here we go. So I'm gonna take my transfer from the corner and pull it just so I can get toward the middle and then pull up. Ta-da! Look at that, that looks so good. Now that I'm done with my transfer, I have a container here full of water and I'm going to place my transfer in the water because remember, we don't want the paste to uh, dry in, in the tr on the transfer. So here we have that. And as I said, just a little bit of water. I can take some from my container. We'll clean up. I don't know if you can see that little dot I have right there. Cleans it right up. Now once the Talkology paste dries, this will be, you will be able to touch it and it, it will not come off. It only comes off with water. If you want to have it permanent, then you'll need to seal it with something. But here's the finished project. I just love the way they came out. So um, once you've have, let me show you how to clean up your transfer. It's, I have it soaking in water. I'm going to bring my towel back. And I'm going to get my transfer out. Just kind of move it around in the water. And then I'm going to do The, this is the sticky part. I'm gonna put that down on the towel. Then you're going to take a, either a Clorox wipe, a Lysol wipe, <clears throat> any kind of disinfectant wipe, and you just wipe off your transfer. Like this. Then you take Turn it around and you wipe the back. It's already starting to stick to me. When you do this, it's activating the sticky again. So oop, it's already getting very sticky. So we, uh, once you've cleaned it off like that, you just set it somewhere to dry. And once it's dry, you put it back on your carrier sheet. See, the glossy side is the side that you want to put uh, on it once it's dry. And there you go. Here is a project from start to finish using our awesome Tricology paste. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so as I post more tutorials, you can come and check them out. And if you would like uh, more information about joining my team, please type join in the comments. Or if you want to join my VIP group where I give special discounts, please type VIP in the comments and I will be sure to add you. Thanks so much. I hope you enjoyed the project. Have a great day or night wherever you're at.